Yo guys, how's it going? We are back again for another video and today we're, as you can see, on GTA 5 with these... I didn't know he had such beefy calves, but god damn he's got some calves on him, but... Yeah, we're back in the story mode, you know, we're playing through this at the moment. This is episode 2, so we're gonna go and hop right into episode 2. So, I don't know what we want to do first, I guess... We'll go over to... Assassination? That sounds pretty fun. So I've obviously, it's been four years since spread the story, so this is basically like me playing through it too. I've never actually completed it as well, which I said in episode one, but yeah, I've never completed the story, which might seem weird because I'm such a god online, but yeah, basically, this is my first time, and if you guys are watching, could be your first time, could not be, sir. So. Alright, we're pulling up now to the assassination. I, I don't know what it means, but I'm assuming, oh, I'm assuming I'm going to have to kill someone, which is always a bit of fun, but you know, return as Franklin... I can do that. I can do that. I forgot how to do that. I can't do that yet. Okay. So that's going to be a Trevor mission. Oh, here we go. Okay. Phone session. Yes. I don't know. Okay. I can now change back to Franklin. So I'm going to do that. Also, that phone call was just a bit of weird. Like him telling him he should find himself. Go be a hippie pretty much. Also, I've turned the game volume up so you guys can hear it a bit better. I don't know how loud it's going to be. So hopefully it's not too bad. But yeah, it should be okay. Oh, now this looks like a pretty sick car. We're now going to go do Old Assassination. Also, I was back to college today. Well, yesterday, but yeah, I was back. It was all right. I only had one lesson, so that was fine. But also, I said I wouldn't be able to upload daily, but I've thought of a plan so that I can upload daily. So basically, I'm going to have to like put a lot of work in for it, but I'm going to record two videos the night before, and then I can edit one that night as well, and then I can upload it that night as well, so it's... Like that, and then I can edit the next one the day after, and then record another one. So it's going to have to go like that, I think. That sounds really confusing, but hopefully it'll work out like that. No promises, though, but even if I'm not uploading daily, it'll be every other day, so, yeah. So who the fuck don't you like today? Guys called Isaac Penny, ruthless vulture capitalist. They're about to take a controlling interest in Vapid Motor Company and sell thousands of workers down the river. Penny's uh, one of those tight-fisted billionaires, rides the same bus to and from work every day. I was thinking he could take over the route and... Drop the asshole, where to go? I've got it. Good. Oh, one thing. If I was you, I wouldn't buy any Vapid stock until the acquisition falls through. Okay, there was Lester. Right, now we've got to get the bus. Okay, I've made it to the bus stop. Now, I'm pretty sure I just wait for the bus. There it is, okay. So I just get on the bus. I have so many guns. Jesus. I was not expecting that, but okay. Alright, let's just get on the bus. I'll be back once we've located the old target. You would not have hopped on this bus, I'm just saying. The amount that has just gone on. So that's him. Also, I'm pretty sure... Um... Also, I've never actually watched a playthrough of GTA 5 story, which is so weird, I think. Like, everyone's seen how the story ends, but I've never actually seen it, so this is, like, brand new to me, pretty much. Which just seems, like, odd. Okay, we've escaped him. Green light. Good to go. Okay, there we go, the bus assassination. Nice. Let's just continue there. Alright, let's go over, because we're already near him, we'll just go over to Barry. <laughs> Barracuda Barry. If any of you guys know who Barracuda Barry is, let me know. If not, he's... <laughs> I can't put it up on screen because the video will get taken down. But he's basically this <laughs> this big, like, big, beefy guy. <laughs> it's mad. He got airdrop around my school for some reason. He's this big, beefy black guy and he's just got his dick out. And it is the size of that lamppost. I'm not even joking. It is mental. Do not search it up if, if you, like, don't know who it is. Just save yourself. But it, it's crazy. It just randomly got airdropped around my school, like, there was this time in, like, year 8, during tech, uh, food tech or something, someone just chose on their phone this big, probably black guy. Okay, so basically that was just him talking about smoking weed. Alright, Barry is now a new contact. Okay, we will now go up to P and just get all of our Franklin missions done for now. I don't know who P is, to be honest, I've completely forgot. I think I did when I originally played through for like the first time on story. I know I said I haven't completed it, but I did do a bit. I did up to like the freighter mission where it's like the first heist, the very first one, but I never actually completed it. I just got there and just couldn't be asked. I don't know why, because they seem really fun. I guess just because all my friends are playing and I wanted to be on like with them, so that's really why. But now, yeah, I decided I'll do this. 
I've made it up to the mysterious P icon. PP. Um, yeah, I don't know who it is to be honest, but it looks like a pretty decent car. So I'm stealing that up. What the fuck? Oh, he's the photographer. Right, this is where we have to take a picture of those. I'm just going to skip that because I've seen it before. I'm pretty sure at some point we take a picture of some guy shagging in a back garden. Okay, not yet, obviously. Alright, I guess I changed to Trevor. Right, we're now Trevor, my boy. I want to get one of his neck tattoos where it's like cut here. I don't know why, just because say, I got one to be honest, because why not? You'll see it one day, I swear to god, you'll see it. If I ever get big on YouTube, which probably won't happen, but if I ever do, I'm not actually going to say that because then I'll actually have to get one if it happens. Hopefully it happens, but yeah. Look at him, he's such a fucking specimen. Right, I guess we'll go to Barry. Oh, okay, the chef. High screw member unlocked, okay. That's that seems pretty good. Also, if you if you guys want to know the story of like why I actually got GTA 5, I'll tell you, just let me know down in the comments, but it's a weird story of like how it happened, because I wasn't even meant to have it. Where the freaking hell is Barry? Oh, I'm assuming that's him and I just ran past him. Legalize weed! No another most important thing. Welfare. Legalization. Here, sign. Shit, where's my pen? Where's my pen? Legalization of what? Of things the founding fathers took as a right. Medicinal plants. Medicinal plants. Fucking kidding me? I make a shitload of money selling that, alright? The last thing I can handle is legalization. Now, fuck off! <laughs> right. No, I don't, I don't want to smoke here. Interferes with the speed. It's really good me. I give you. Yes. It's a real mellow contemporary. Oh shit, that ain't no weed. Oh shit! That ain't no weed! That ain't no weed! Look at this weed! This is... I want some of this good shit. I'm joking, but... Damn, what was what this fella giving us? Destroyed the clown van. Shit, this is all the people that be hating on me. This is where they come from, these clown vans. Because all they are are fucking clowns. This shotgun seems to reach quite the distance too. Another one of them gone. Where are you going to respawn from now, all you little... I don't actually have any haters, which I'm pretty happy about, but who knows. Actually, there was one guy that said how... I can't remember what he said, but... You guys backed me up. You are like, shut up, Chasma Jags. You were like, shut up, Chasma Jags is good. And I, I appreciate that. So thanks to you guys. I can't destroy this van for some reason. Come on. Let me destroy you. Okay, there we go. But yeah, also, the, the... I don't know why I spoke about hate, but... Yeah, I've never really had hate. All I've ever really had on my videos is positivity, so thank you everyone that has, like, supported. It means a lot. I like how I'm saying all this while I'm killing loads of clowns as Trevor in fucking GTA 5. Jesus Christ, why is there so many of you? And we beat the grassroots. Trevor, okay, what is he doing? Right, well, shall I go up and see Martin? Why not? Why not? I, th I think we've not really done much this episode yet, so I guess I'll go see Martin. Trevor's like the ultimate shit talker, like... In Modern Warfare 2 lobbies, or like any old COD lobbies, or like any COD lobby at all for that matter. If you die, you never admit it's your fault, do you? You're like, okay, it was just the internet, or it was just my gun. Trevor's like, he crashed directly into someone, and he's like, you blind piece of shit. Like, it was clearly your fault. He's just the ultimate shit talker. We're looking for Mr. Madrazo. Trevor about to act up. All right. Okay, that cutscene's done. It wasn't really that interesting. It was just basically him saying some shit about Martine and how Trevor doesn't like, or Michael doesn't like him, sorry. So the plot is thickening. So you're gonna drive into me. I don't know if you guys could hear that, but I just crashed right into him and Michael just said, so you're gonna drive into me. I don't know if you could hear Michael though. Get in the van! That's my best pickup line, you know? When someone when you walk up to someone you just told a gun to the head. Get in the van! No, that is not a good pickup line. Do not use it. I'm joking, it's a banger. Oh, what's this? I'm in I'm in me mum's van. Broom, broom. Oh, it's a rifle. 
our team of Drazzo ain't someone to be messing with. Wind direction. Take down the jet. Where's the jet? Oh, I found the. That ain't the jet, is it? That isn't a jet. That's a. That's a bloody helicopter. I got her. Southwest of the city. Found it. Gotta give a lead. Ah shit. Easy. Look at that. Easy. Oh wait, I missed it. <laughs> oh dear, that was quite embarrassing. Easy, look at that, easy! Oh, I just take these jets out like it's nobody's business. I see these jets like boom, boom. That was honestly... Uh, I was actually missed. Okay, what am I doing, what am I doing? Follow the plane, follow the plane, okay. There you go. Don't need that, don't care. I've done enough of these missions in online to know how to fucking handle them. I feel like if I stop swearing as well, I might get like more viewers because I feel like I'll be putting the algorithm more. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try that out and see if it actually works like that. Oh sh shit! I've already failed. But oh well, I just died. That is how did he die? He's actually at pathetic. How did he die from such a small, small fall? Ooh, I rhyme full with small. Biggie Smalls is the rap genius, but I'm second best. I come through, clean this, rap game up. Ain't nobody stepping to me. Ain't nobody fucking with me. You get slapped up like a PIMP is at your chest. With a knife digging in your kidney. Ooh, my rhymes are tight. Look at that beauty of a stunt! This is, Niner, this is this, I love the story mode, like it is it is cool. Like how everything happens and stuff. I do find it pretty cool, but I've just never taken the time to play it. Uh oh, uh oh, ah oh. I do not know what that was. And I apologize to everyone that had to listen. But it happened and you're just gonna have to get over it boys, but I'm sorry. Sorry for making you think you have permission to speak when no one asked. I'm so sad, I've just done that to myself. Alright, I see the smoke, I see the smoke. Jeez, this guy is fighting this jet, isn't he? Like, he, he's just trying to make distance, I don't know what he thinks he's going to do. Whoa, whoa, oh, look at that. Pull your flaps. <laughs> what? Hey, <laughs> that's kind of sus. Methamphetamines. Okay, they're dropping, they're dropping. Ooh, you look like you're going down there, boys. You look like you're going down. Ooh, I'm about to go in the traffic. Okay, that's fun. You look like you're about to go down there, boys. Onto old Ron's airfield. They are in the dirt. Okay, I gotta take someone out. Trevor's got even more weapons. Right, go inside, okay. I am inside the plane. Right, I think he's finding some files, so... Oh dear, the poor captain just took an L. Oh, we got them, we got them, okay, cool. Air Emu. T! Okay, so all I've got to do is drop these off, I'm pretty sure. I can do that. Oh, I don't even have to drop them off. Oh, I've got to get rid of the rifle, he just said, so I'm going to have to ditch the rifle, as um, the gangsters may say. Okay, now I've got to destroy the van. See, I've got to ditch the rifle. Okay, I'm just going to destroy here because I don't want to travel really far. Jerry can. Cool. He just pulled that out of nothing. I have now jerry canned said van. I could have just used a grenade. But I ain't about that life. Watch her burn! Burn baby, burn baby. Burn baby, burn. Yes! 
What to do? Find a car. I need to find a car. Your car will do. What? There's been a change of plans. You don't need to come to the ranch. Meet me at Stoner Cement Works. A little left Sonora Road from there. What are you doing, Trevor? Nothing you wouldn't do. Oh dear. Trevor. Trevor's acting up, as one might say. He's going to the Cement Works. Trevor is actually acting up. Yeah, so I'm going to leave a few cutscenes in, like, just so everyone understands, like, what I'm speaking about. But then some of them I'm just going to take out, which you will have seen, like, already. But ones like that I'm going to leave in, otherwise it wouldn't have made sense. Right, so I've made it here. Let's see what I've got to do. Where is oh, God. Oh, there's two. Oh, the fuck has happened? Why do you have his... He's a turd, huh? No wonder people are stabbing him in the back. What happened? Oh god. Bastard. You know, I really don't know why you mess around with people like that, Mike. I mean, really, I no. don't. Answer the fucking question. Milo! He asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. And he kind of got a little angry. So, I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you <laughs> kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh. But I did kidnap his wife. Oh. <laughs> Legendary scene. Legendary scene. What did you do? Oh, I just told you what I just did. Oh, now, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think... No, I didn't kill him. But I didn't kidnap his wife. A little while, well, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think... Why don't you pop in the back? All right, now, Patricia. She already called shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice oh, little shit. place we can hang out. You know, it's a, a very relaxing little spot. A little getaway, if you will. A cabin in the woods. You know what I'm saying. Okay, and that is that mission completely done. That was, that was actually pretty fun. You had to take down the plane. But I've been recording for 40 minutes, so I'm going to have to end it off there. And I'm going to have to get editing very quickly. Oh, we, we and his Franklin. It's Chop! But yeah, that's going to end it off for today's video. Sorry if you can hear the dog bark and I, I, he won't shut up. I've already told him to, but yeah, sorry about that. But yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button, obviously. And hit the subscribe button and the bell notification while you're there. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.